called kissing bugs because they like to take blood from around a mouth when a person is asleep. Doctors say the bite is painful and there's no vaccine against a deadly disease. It's treatable, but if you don't notice the symptoms early, you can have lifelong health problems. But I have seen it in the backyard. You know, they, they, they can be deadly. <gasps> No, really? Yeah. Carrie Hoff's family is now learning the true potential of kissing bugs that live in her backyard. That's intimidating to know that there are, you know, life-threatening bugs just living among us. That looks like just a normal bug, but it's not. <laughs> so does that kind of scare you guys? Yes, definitely. <laughs> yes, very scary. Kissing bugs are deadly because they carry a disease called Chagas. Dr. Daniel Springer is an entomologist with the Shelby County Health Department. He doesn't believe there will be an outbreak in the Mid-South, but wants people to know how dangerous one bite can be from these bugs. This doesn't sound very nice, but what happens is that when they begin to feed, they defecate, and then the person rubs the bite, and it either gets into the mouth or they touch their eye and then they become infected that way. The danger of the disease is not in the initial stages of the infection. Mm -hmm. The danger comes from there are primary, secondary, and tertiary effects. Dr. Springer says if you're bitten, your skin will swell, develop a rash, body aches, and have a loss of appetite. In extreme cases, victims will develop enlarged hearts or intestines, which can fail or burst, causing sudden death. If left untreated, the parasite can eventually make its way to the heart, where it can live and multiply. The disease is especially dangerous for kids. I think any bug that bites you could kill you is kind of scary. I mean, lately it's been brown recluse spiders and flesh-eating, you know, bacteria you can get and snakes. We found Definitely. some snakes in our backyard and now there's the West Nile virus. I mean, it's a lot to take care of. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Just a, another big bug to watch for. Right. Well, thank you. I will. I'm trying to, like, memorize that bug and make sure that if I see it again, we'll be very careful. The best way to get rid of these kissing bugs, keep your house clean and use insecticides. Now, if you think you've been bitten, go see a doctor. Jackie Orozco, ABC 24 News.